So that's a wax and grease remover <clears throat> over the quarter panel. I'm pretty happy with that. So I'd say that's ready for glaze. All right. Yep. Anthony, I'm glad you're uh, trying to lose weight. Just uh, don't be unhealthy trying to catch up with me because that's going to be like, it, it, yeah, you know what it's going to be like. Hey, so something I thought I would just say. I go through a lot of these gloves because I sort of, well not sort of, I have a rule for myself. Don't touch the car. Um, Non-painted parts, let's say. If there's going to be paint in the parts future, don't touch the car with bare hands. Only gloves. I've um, made a little farting noise and whatever. Um, this car has been in bare metal, or huge chunks of it have been in bare metal for six months, <clears throat> give or take. And just a little spot of rust here, a little spot of rust there. When I see a spot of rust, I'll blast it with phosphoric acid. And, uh, you know, then I'll, like, sand the excess off. And that's it. It doesn't rust. So, but maybe a big part of that is I'm careful not to touch the bare metal. And if I have to move parts, like even the, the deck lid and the hood around, or cowl and trunk pieces, gloves, gloves only. So these, hopefully tonight, I, I have to prep them, put them in a, a good scratch, 220 scratch, and they're going to get a blast of 450. So I can also try out my newly cleaned all the way through gun. So, uh, yeah. <laughs> Anthony, I'm glad you're losing weight. You're going to be at about 50 pounds, maybe, by the time I'm done. So, and just because you lose doesn't mean you should stop and head right to 7-Eleven and get a Slurpee. So, deck lid trim piece, cowl, and uh, front bumper trim piece, which is steel by the way. The one on the back, the rear bumper, is plastic. Maybe, you know, this is, that's what uh, protects you in, a, in an impact. So anyway. I'm going to tape some stuff off and spray, yeah, like a feral cat.
So, not bad. I'm not trying here. Hang on. I'm not trying to uh, pound it all on so it covers in one coat, but it's much, much smoother. No, no spatter. It does have a little bit of texture to it. That's not bad, though. Nothing like what I had before, where it was coming out of the gun in bursts. I did thin it down to, like, it was less than 5% acetone just to get it through. So, very pleased. And I've got enough in the gun to do another swipe after flash time, which is 10 to 15 minutes. Alright, what do we have here? This is after the second layer, layer? Coat of epoxy primer so let's see if we've got uh, texture like we had before well it's kind of spotty but it doesn't look like stucco it's got a little bit of relief to it but not bad so cowl piece uh, deck lid trim piece and front bumper metal trim piece are all in epoxy primer. So those are going to be ready for the high build primer. And none of them need any body work. They're all, they're all perfect. Um, not, not my doing they they're just in good shape so those will be ready for however many coats of primer hell they could probably just be sanded and go straight to uh color but i'll treat them like the rest of the car for practice if nothing else so what else have i been doing here you saw that i sanded this to just needing glaze so, uh, yeah, Anthony, quarter panel is nearly ready for etch. Yep. And as you can see, I've already started masking off the trunk hole. The, uh, the rubbers, the seal on this, I'm going to replace. Um... I'm just I'm going to leave it on the car though until I've got the replacements in hand. This is the it glues in place. It doesn't clip in place and you'll see I'm not I'm not done taping it down because I'm out of my green tape. So, I have masking tape. I did a loop around to pull some of the the weather strip out of the way so that I can get you know, paint in there. And I'm thinking about masking off the window so that when it comes time to etch the rest, I'll be ready to do that. So, I'm sorry, Anthony, closing in on it. Way faster than you can healthily do the 70 pounds. So, It's all right, you know. If I'll I'll be the bigger person. Well, <laughs> not really the bigger person, but uh, I'll offer to just buy my own dinner if uh, need be. Yeah, you can be the bigger person. <laughs> oh, jeez.